everybody watching me today. How are you? How are you? Are you alright? That's okay. Well, hello to Five Gaming Gents today. Um, because we're going back to our roots. Our first ever video was Guild Wars, and it's been a while since we played Guild Wars. So, what are we doing today? Well, me, Adam, and Craig. On the wonderful idea of returning to this brilliant game after a few months of, um, let's say, um, hibernation. Is that the word? Kind of the word for it. We haven't played it in a while, so we thought we'd do something a bit, bit challenging for us to try and put together, but it'll be hopefully enjoyable to watch three separate, um, storylines, spanning three different species, spanning three different completely original stories, because that's what God was is, you pick your own story. So there you go, I'll be playing a char story with this fella here, who I've already created, so I can spare you the time and watch me make him. Um, Adam, I believe, is doing a Silvari story, and Craig is doing an Asura one. Um, so we'll have three different series about these three stories, and now and again we might group together to do a bit of um PvP will be world multiplayer kind of stuff. So yeah, it's a bit of a, a bit of a journey for everyone involved. So if you don't know Guild Wars, or if you do, if you don't, it should be fun. So I have the eight classes that are here. Uh Elements this warrior, guardian, engineer, mesmer, thief, necromancer and ranger I have picked the Guardian because it is a very nice class. It is a mixture of def of magic and tank basically. The thing about all classes is you can specialise, do whatever you want. They're not shackled by anything. A uh, guardian can heal and tank. Basically, anyone can act as a tank if they really wanted to, but probably guardian warrior would be the best. Um, so, yeah, I picked guardian. I've done all the uh, the characterizations for it, so yeah, it's taking a while, but I think I've gone for the more like ginger look. Ginger! Um, so yeah, so this is what Guild Wars story is, picking your own different choices, you can see down the bottom here, uh, there's 10 things you have to do to set up your, um, personal storyline, and for the Guardian, the first one you pick is what you want to do, do you wear, uh, these shoulder things, these shoulder things, or this helmet thing, yeah, I went for these shoulder things, because I think they look the best, uh, I like the look of these shoulder things. Uh, so Conqueror's Pauldrons, uh, Fanatic's Pauldrons, and uh, a Visionary's Helmet. So yeah, I went for the Conqueror's Pauldrons. Um, and then, trouble may follow me, but I use my something to overcome it. So yeah, you either, are you a charmer? Are you a level-headed dignitary who likes to solve arguments logically? Or are you just a brute who could use his ferocity for good? Yeah, so I've gone for the level-headed logical thinker for my fella here. Um, this is the Char bit. Uh, I am proud to be um, part of the Blood Legion, because, you know, the Char are the uh, military race. They're all bred to go to war. So the Blood Legion is the legion that um, goes straight into battle. Uh, so, yeah, they're basically the frontline soldiers. I could have picked the Ash one, which becomes the Shadow Thieves or the Engineers in the Iron Legion. But I went for the Blood Legion because there you go. Uh, I've never played uh, a chance story before, so I don't know what's going to happen, but I've gone for Blood Legion. Uh, I will die for my warband, especially my sparring partner. Uh, so there's several different ones. Uh, Maverick, who's a warrior, but I, didn't, I decided not to go for Maverick, seeing as I'm a guardian. Uh, Uriel, Uriel, who's a necromancer. Uh, Clawsper, the thief, Dinky, another guardian, or Reva, the engineer, I believe. So I went for Clawsper. Uh, so he might be a funny chap. Um, they tell me the soldier that side me is a what now? Uh, a loyal soldier, a sorcerer, a shaman, or a honorless gladium? I went for the loyal soldier, just to shake things up. So, there we go, to sum things up on the side here. That's basically the story I've chosen to set it up with. Uh, let me think of a, a good name. Timothy... Timothy Fidgets. Let's go! I am a char. Mm. In 
this world of constant battle, I am the deadliest weapon of all. I respect no authority but the clenched fist of my legion. With engines of destruction, we have killed our gods. We reclaimed our homeland of Ascalon, and we planted victory banners on the graves of our enemies. Yet, if we waver, it could slip through our claws. Victory, at any cost. The Blood Legion is my mother. The Blood Legion is my father. We char are born into battle. We live on the fields of war. And I, I will die fighting. I'm a soldier, a ground pounder, frontline infantry. I face the enemy head on. I've earned the respect of my comrades and forged alliances I can call on in time of need. In the Blood Legion, we're taught the meaning of the word duty. We are relentless. Today, the soldiers of the Black Citadel assault the ghosts that plague this land. I've been assigned to reinforce the Bulwark. Let the Ash Legion strike from the shadows. Let the Iron Legion build its machines of war. I will not stop fighting until the only thing left standing on the field of battle is me. This is my story. Okay, opening cinematic done. Fury of the Dead. Opening mission. And if it loads, it should be a hot diggity time of a beetle matter. Whatever that means, boy, I don't know what that means. So, here we go then. Fury of the Dead, and we, the little char guy here. Oh, thanks, game. Piss off. We've got to have to try and get rid of these ghosts. They're attacking our homeland. Got orders from me, have you? Talk. The ghost army have been bashing at the gate for weeks. They're finally broken through. By the way, they threw the funnel report to Centurion crying skin for orders. Where are the ghosts? Ah, oh, there's some ghosts. Die, ghosts. With my one move that I've got. Ah, uh, because I'm a guy and I start with the, uh, the mace. Zoom out a bit. Get a bit of you. The battle. Smash him. Smash him. Come on, Timothy Fidgets. Maverick. Oh, I was one of those guys at the beginning. Maverick. That's awesome. So all those chaps at the beginning who I could have chosen from are in the, are in the game. <gasps> I need your help, soldier. Tribune Brimstone has ordered me to the crypt. To torn up to make it. What's so important that the Blood Legion Tribune is there? Ghost of Duke Beriton is far more powerful than we thought. His army just broke through our defenses. Ritlock's about to fight him head on. If he succeeds, it'll be weeks before the Ghost reforms, and we can rebuild our perimeter. On my way. Timmy Fidgets is on his way. Let's go do some fighting. Clawsper. Timothy with Vidgets. <gasps> Can I eat? Oh, I can't use the artillery. Come on then. Let's... Ang Ascalonian peasant! You damn peasant! Oh, I've got some rewards. Oh, I got some rewards from logging in, apparently. Okay, let's go Ascalonian Peasants. 
Oh, it's Dinky. That's Uriel. Die, bitch. I'll save you. Smash him with your mace, boy. I don't understand why ghosts are fighting me, but I'm sure it will come clear. Yeah, are we there yet? There we are. Stand down. Forget your orders. No one goes into this crypt unless I command it. This crypt orders we have to make sure the ghosts don't follow him. Which means don't you know? Oh, I've been scattered. I'll go around the map. Uh, hey! Piss off! There's another guy here who's helping me. He seems, he seems to be a warrior. Yeah, he's a warrior. Defend the gate from the ghosts. Oh, there's quite a few of them. Ah. Oh, there's, there's loads. Oh, there's, there's, there's quite a few players here now. That, that chap seems to be a bit thinner than me. Oh, I've got gold. Here we go, guys! Come on! This guy's got funny horns. Whoa, that guy's got a giant sword. Where is he? Oh, he's gone. <laughs> that was a chap with a big sword. Oh, I wanted to see his sword. Yeah, in the crypt, there's a fight some ghosts. Smash him! Smash him! Quite a few ghosts. Why don't we just blow up the tomb? Yeah! Come on, Timothy! Oh, he's a mesmer. Why are you a mesmer? Shah mesmer. Slightly homosexual uh, magic character with this giant cross between a lion and a bull. Why are you here? Ah, uh, come on. Defeat them. Yeah. I like our bath. Uh, oh, drink Baradin. Filthy animal! Wow, well, who's racist? You're a bit of a racist, aren't you? No, you won't. Way to go. Oh my! I see he wants to get dirty. Defeat the giant Duke Baradin. Beware of his giant swinging it. Oh, he's got the fear move, making us run away from him. No, that's got a ranged weapon, so he's got to keep going back in. Oh, so many ghosts. There's still ghosts here. We've almost got him. Now we did it! Opening mission done. I heard what you did down in that crypt, soldier. Impressive. Tribune Brimstone was calling the shots. 
I just did my job. Don't sell yourself short. You were part of the team that took down Baradin and stopped the ghost assault. Smokestead is safe now, and you helped make it that way. People are still on edge, though. It'd help if they saw someone like you making the rounds, lending a hand. The quicker we get this place squared away, the sooner the Legions can get back to business. You can help. I'd rather have volunteers. But if I have to issue an order, I will. That won't be necessary, Legionnaire. I hereby volunteer. <laughs> My teeth. I just noticed. I just... Oh, yeah, here we go. I got a mace. And some gold and some experience. Leveled up to level 2, and I unlock Symbol of Faith. Damage throws and regenerates allies. 